Lately, I've been working on my porf developer's portfolio, my resume, so I could hopefully find a job in computer science. Most of my professional background is in industrial manufacturing, so it, it's difficult for me to do an entire career change. Now, I, I've been coding since I was about five or six years old. My first programming language was basic. And um, so I, I know my stuff, but I don't know, have my stuff on paper. So what this program here is what I've built is a, a demo or that interviews you mock questions. So I'm gonna go ahead and we're gonna just skip to this real quick so I can show you how it really works. So I'm gonna go ahead and click something technical. Well, what this is going to do is it's going to go ahead and the interview is going to ask me questions. I'm going to answer these questions and it's going to transcribe them into text. After text, it'll send it to the AI. The AI will give, will uh, read through it and then give me feedback based off of my responses. So I'm going to give a really bad response and then I'm going to give the correct response. So the question is, what is the hash table and what is the average case and worst case time for each of its operations? Okay. So I'm going to tell it up front that I don't really know anything about it. I'm going to give it a bad example. I'm going to be a, give it tangent. I'm going to give it uh, redundant information that doesn't, that's not even relevant to the, the question. What is a hash table? And what is the average case and worst case time for each of its operations? A hash table can be sort of like a, maybe like a spreadsheet. You have a bunch of different hashes and different cells, and you want to find them. You divide by the remainders. Uh, Average case, I'm not too sure. Worst case, I believe it's something with an ON. And I, I do not know, understand on any of the operations. I believe we do divide by one. But to be completely honest, I do not know the answer to this question. So now what it's going to do is it's going to process my trans it's process the audio and transcribe it. And then it's going to develop some feedback for me. A hash table can be sort of like a, maybe like a spreadsheet. You have a bunch of different hashes and different cells, and you want to find them, you divide by the remainders. Uh, average case, I'm not too sure. Worst case, I believe it's something with an ON. And I, I do not know, understand on any of the operations. I believe we do divide by one. But to be completely honest, I do not know the answer to this question. So now, here's the feedback we got. The candidate's response to the question on the hash table is not relevant and does not provide a clear understanding of the topic. They mention a vague comparison to the spreadsheet and mentioning dividing by remainders, but do not provide a clear explanation of how a hash table works or its purpose. Additionally, the candidate states that they are unsure about the average case time complexity and only vaguely mention that the worst case may have an ON complexity. They admit to not understanding any of the operations involved in a hash table. Overall, the candidate's response does not demonstrate a sufficient understanding of the topic and does not address the question effectively. Feedback on communication skills. The candidate's response cl lacks clarity and coherence. They struggle to explain their thoughts in a clear and organized manner. Their response is also not focused on the question and includes irrelevant information. They admit they lack their lack of knowledge on the topic, which shows honesty, but also highlights a lack of preparedness. Improvement is needed in their ability to communicate effectively and stay on topic during an interview. Now that's pretty impressive if you think about it. I mean, that's solid, solid feedback. So now let's try it out with the correct answer. I, I pulled from my custom chat dash. So, so here we go. This is the a more correct, concise answer. What is a hash table? And what is the average case and worst case time for each of its operations? A hash table is like a super organized cabinet that links keys to values for efficient data lookups. The hash function turns the key into a unique number or a hash used to locate data. On average, storing or retrieving data takes consistent time, constant time, 01, as we know the exact location. But in a worst case scenario where multiple keys get hashed at the same location causing a collision, the time may increase to linear time complexity, that is ON, as we'd have to search through these keys. Normally though, good hash functions keep this scenario rare. Let's go ahead and process that transcript. Now that, that's a fairly, that, that's solid, solid uh, response. A hash table is like a super organized cabinet that links keys to values for efficient data lookups. The hash function turns the key into a unique number or a hash used to locate data. On average, storing or retrieving data takes consistent time, constant time, 01, as we know the exact location. But in a worst case scenario where multiple keys get hashed at the same location causing a collision, the time may increase to linear time complexity, that is ON. 
as we'd have to search through these keys. Normally, though, good hash functions keep this scenario rare. And there it is. Let's know what you guys think.